Hi everyone, welcome to Victoria Station on the London Underground. We are here and we're going to do a short run to Edgware Road. So let's quickly hop on. I don't think we've started from uh, Victoria before. That's a wee bit tight. I, I, uh, okay. Um, I can't get in. I can't, I can't get in. Serious? Uh, okay, okay. This is not the great start we needed, to be fair. Um, so what we're going to have to do is open the doors from the other side of the train, then be able to get in from that way. Oh my goodness me. We're going to be late. I can see it already. What an, what an auspicious start to the series. Blimey. Right, let's get in. Sit down. Sit down. Uh, we need to put some power on. And we need to open the doors. Right. <laughs> we need to run all the way back. Uh, evening. Oh, it's, yes, it is evening. We're doing an evening shift. It's about 7 o'clock in the evening. Uh, if I can see a clock somewhere, I'll probably actually... Can I bring up the... No, I can't bring up the route monitor at this time. Um, so let's hop in here. There we go. Right. We've got a train waiting for us to leave the station. Um... And he's probably going to be surprised when I uh, jump on here. Right, uh, what do we need to do? We need to come over here. We need to put the tail lights on. Uh, the cab ventilation. Uh, gauge lights, dash lights, destination light, cab light. We don't need to put the cab light on. Um, cool. Do we need to... No, we probably won't set that one to be fair. So let's hop out close that door and rather than run all the way and open all the interior doors we're going to run around, run down the platform It'll be far quicker in the long run as I said we're going Victoria to Edgware Road um, so there's gonna, we're going to be past Sloan Square, South Kensington Gloucester Road, High Street Kensington Notting Hill Gate, Bayswater Paddington and into Edgware Road. Right, let's sit down. How are we doing on time? It's 7.04. We are due to depart at 7.08. Oh. <sighs> Take stock. Okay. They gave us a little bit of time to actually do that, which is quite nice. I'm exhausted and I am actually just sitting here talking for three minutes. I haven't actually done that running, but it feels like I have. That's how uh, immersive this game can be. Right, do the cab, let's switch the saloon heating on, light switch on, light trip is okay, that's the brake, emergency brake, we don't need to worry about that for now, hop over here, Whew. okay, so we are going to, what did I say, Edgware Road, that's right, there we go, as that comes trundling in, um, I just remembered something. We didn't close the door. We didn't close the back door in the cab. Um, so I want to do that before we get pinged for that. Oh, this could be a little bit close on the old time Rooney on departure. But safety first. Safety first. We've got to get that close. Yeah, yeah, see, I was right. God, good, thank goodness for my memory. Burning the calories today. Woo! I bet these people are standing around going, "What? What's going on? Why is Why is the train driver running up and down the platform? That'd get you nervous, wouldn't it? That train is probably still waiting for us, right? How are we doing? Oh, we still got time. Look at that. My fitness knows no bounds. Right. Let's get this program. Program. We are going in a in a rail. Oh, I want to put enter. Uh, the start is going to be Victoria, and the end will be Edgware. Now that was Edgware start, and I want to get Edgware end. Oops. Uh, destination Hammersmith. No. I'm going. No, it's not the start. I don't understand. I don't understand. 
It's one of these things, I just do not get this. I'm going to stick that one in there. This is Victoria. Well, that's right, at least. Right, let's close our door. Let's um, put that in gear. Let's pop that down. Build up some pressure. Whew. It's been a while. Is that everything? Did she say via... No, that's wrong. That is wrong. Now, I'm looking at the map, as instructed, and they said, look on the... In if it's on the inside... It's the inner rail, and I, we are going on the inside, so why is it not the inner rail? That makes no sense, then. That makes absolutely no sense. I'm sorry, that makes absolutely... So what does the outer rail do, then? From... Victoria... So it's the outer rail, so that was wrong. Anyway, we need to get going. Let's go. Okay, we are uh, 30 seconds behind already. That sounds right. That's right. So this outer rail. So what I was told is wrong. Oh well. Never mind. Anyway, 40 miles an hour. Let's blast up to 40 miles an hour as we fly into Sloan Square in 600-odd metres. What's important is we got the announcements correct before we left the station, which is good. It makes a change. Ah, and I'm just wondering, should I have set the destination board to a circle line? Possibly, possibly so. Sounds like we're straining, but we can do 37 man there. It's a speed limit of 40, that's fine. As we rock the through the uh, dark tunnels. Square. Yes, it is. Oh, here we go. Sloan Square. Mind the gap, everyone. Mind the gap. I'm going, to, I'm going to change this to circle line. By changing it, either way we're going to get pinged for that, but I'm not too worried. Uh, right, okay, we're due to depart here uh, now, so... Make a bit of time up. Okay, we're only 20 seconds behind there. Oof. It's all that running about. It's got my blood boiling. I think that's what it is. Just need to calm down. Oh, wow. Okay, 40 miles an hour. Signal uh, is green in 650 meters. South Kensington is in 1,000 meters. And we're due to depart that at uh, 7.13 or 19.13 on the 24-hour clock. I think then we go into Gloucester Road. I think Gloucester Road's one of my favorite. I think it's that's the, my favorite one, where it's got all the um, it's got all the uh, the nice brickwork and stuff, isn't it? Oh, red signal. There you go, red signal. Must be a train. There we go, gone green. Great. Let's um. Pick up the pace then. We must have a train in front of us, so we're going to be like this all the way to Edgware Road, I'm guessing. That's okay. A recommended speed of 30, so we'll stay at 30 ish. Got a green and amber, 20. And we're not allowed into the station. We've got another red light. 
There's the train in front. Okie kokey. It's gone green, but the next light is still red. By the time we get there, it should probably change as that train leaves the uh, the station. There you go, he's gone. It should go green now, so yes. And then the next red signal is at the end of the platform, which is fine. Okay, we were, oh, we've got 30 seconds before we need to depart here. Train approaching. Good service for these uh, these guys. Literally, you wait all day for a train to turn up, then two turn up at once. South Kensington, everyone. Okay. Next sig signal's gone green. So, we do to depart here. At... Um... 1913 which is now but if we just give it another 30 seconds maybe it'll still register that we're on time uh, but it'll also give that train a chance to uh, get a little bit further ahead of us should be good train coming in oh come on Went down the old gears a bit too much then. Ah, red signal in 280 meters. Okay, that didn't get as far as I thought. And this, well, Gloucester Road is literally just down the road, so maybe it's just before Gloucester, yeah, so. So we've got green, amber, red signal lights. So we'll just cruise and hopefully cruising a little bit will allow us to keep moving yes and the lights to go green the next station is Gloucester Road change for the district line ok red signal unless we're going on the inside track yes we are we're going on the inside track which is green yay we can do a bit of overtaking maybe that would be neat Okay, here we go. Right, we are here at 14 minutes past. We are due to part at 15 minutes past, so we've got a, a few seconds. Busy here, isn't it? Wow, look at them getting in and out. 7 o'clock, I guess people are leaving the city and uh, it's all going good. Right. We can depart any time. How's old um, Billy Bob here? All right, bud. He's going to Ealing Broadway. Okay. How's it going? It's a good day. Things going well. No dramas. Good. Okay. Before he decides to uh, commit any more. Ah, so he's going off here, I guess. To. Um Is it Fulham Broadway? So he'd be going down that green line, whichever one that is. I don't know, I can't see the key. Ah, interesting. Right. So we should be clear ahead now, so we should be able to get right up to speed and uh, blat it all the way to High Street Kensington. Oh, speed limit changed to 25. I was all over it though. So yeah, wintry months are here. It's dark now at seven. It's, it's not it's not total dark, but it's it's really twilight at seven o'clock. National speed limit applies. Fantastic. Not so here, it would seem. Still at twenty five miles an hour. Dropped a few miles an hour, so let's pick those up. There we go. 400 meters till the next signal, which is green. High Street Kensington is 550 meters, which is uh, getting rapidly closer, and we're due to depart there at 1919. Cool. 25, 24 miles an hour seems incredibly slow, doesn't it?
incredibly slow. The next station is High Street, Kensington. Here we go. Oh, I like the uh, the lighting. It looks all hazy, and that's quite nice actually. As we come into the station, oh, it's busy here. Stand back. See, this is a lot better than the uh, New York subway, people. Oh, well, I say that he crosses the line now. Don't. Oh, God, that, that was dangerous. Don't cross the yellow line. Now, the New York subway guys, they're, they're like literally leaning over the uh, the platform to touch the train. It's like the old 1980s rally, uh, World Rally Championship. Do you remember that? When they used to have like, rows of people in the car driving incredibly quickly between them, and they all they used to try and touch the car. I mean, incredible insanity. And you talk to the drivers of the day, and they used to go skidding around the corners, and they could hear this... Doop, doop, doop. As they were hitting, you know, the back of the car was slapping against people's legs and stuff, and knocking them down. It's, and the, the, you know, then then there was obviously some horrendous accidents, and um, it was changed. But still, if you know what I'm talking about, just Google World Rally Championship in the 80s, and you'll just see the crowds are just terrifyingly close to the cars. I mean, literally, you could. There's literally just enough room to get the car through. Absolutely, and they're you know they're souped-up cars doing crazy miles an hour. Mental, mental. Okay, we've got a few seconds, so let us just do an announcement. Oops, missed. And we're away. So we are li living. We are leaving High Street Kensington, heading to Notting Hill Gate. Notting Hill, of course, famous for that movie with Hugh Grant, and of course the carnival they have every year, which celebrates all the multiculturalism. Uh, it's really good. It's supposed to be. I've never been, but it's supposed to be one of. Um, it's supposed to be a very good thing to go and see if you're ever in London at the time. Pop down and watch the carnival. It's supposed to be very good. I'll do it one day. And apparently, you know, the communities down there, they spend literally the entire year building up to the next, the, I was going to say procession, but the next carnival. They do like, you know, big old um, march with all these colourful costumes and dancing and stuff. Oh, look at this. Notting Hill Gate. This is a station and a half. It's a lovely looking station. Look at that! This is proper nice looking station though, isn't it? Look at that! The arches, not only of the, the brickwork in the uh, the alcoves, or the whatever they call them, um, but also the roof. Isn't that lovely? I like that. It's aesthetically pleasing to me. Okay, we are due to leave here in 21 past, so we got 30 seconds, which is cool. Let's have a little bit of coffee. You can see, you've got hanging baskets. Oh, there's nothing in that one. But they've got hanging baskets with flowers and stuff. This is a really nice station. Come on, people. Come on. Come on. Come on. I know you're going to. Come on. I'll give you a warning. Yeah, they got on. Brilliant. And we're away. 20 seconds behind. Well, I say 20 seconds behind. We're actually on schedule, but we're just playing it comfortable at this stage. Right, from Notting Hill Gate, we go to Bayswater. Let's, let's bring it up to speed. You've got next signal in 900 odd meters, which is fine. Bayswater is in 800. Okay, so that's probably at the end of the platform at Bayswater, the next signal. Cool, look at that big old bit of trunking sticking out there. That was quite. Um, oh, God, I'm speeding. Quite gargantuan, wasn't it? And again, huge bits of trunking down the side of this uh, tunnel. 40 seemed a little bit quick to go around this corner, to be fair. But we're hanging in there. 
Again, more huge trunking. I wonder what's in that. 300 meters to Bayswater. And it's going to be on the left hand side. Makes sense. The next station is Bayswater. See, now this has got the potential to have been a nice. Um, station. It's got the nice brickwork, it's got little alcoves and nice little archways and everything. Uh, but unfortunately the roof just lets it down with the huge um, metal beam... What do you call them? Rafters or whatever. Just sort of going from side to side. It's not the prettiest of things, is it? Is that is that security camera, the little one, looking straight up? What's going on there? I'm not sure. So this is Bayswater. It looks lovely. It's got a little bit of a leak there somewhere. They've got some dripping water coming down. But it's okay. We are due to depart here now, in fact. So let's crack on. From Bayswater, we go to Paddington. And then from Paddington, Edgware Road. So we are not too far from the end of our journey. Right, we've got 40 miles an hour here, so let's crank it right up. There's Paddington for the circle line is in 600 meters. Oh, we've got a train stopped out here. Hong Hong! Now he's moving, he's obviously waiting for the... the whoa, I'm speeding the previous train to uh, leave the station. As we've seen a lot of um, red signals today, haven't we? A couple for us, a couple for other trains as well, because we have the train waiting behind us to come into the station at, right at the start. And we've seen a couple of stations waiting. Into Paddington, we did roll. With a empty keg of ale. See Paddington, it needs a bit of lighting, doesn't it? And maybe some hanging baskets, but it's not that. It's not bad. It's not bad. It's almost there. Uh, and they need a bit more of a roof. They've only got half a roof. But apart from that, it's, it's lovely. Right, do you just part here any second? And then we can head off to Edgware Road. So let's get another announcement in. And we're away. Brilliant. On time. Looking great. So, it's only a short hop now into Edgware. And our scorecard, which obviously we're not going to do brilliantly on because we've, A, we've changed the uh, destination board. We didn't set the destination board at the back because I wanted to see if that actually makes a thing. If it actually has an impact on the score, and we'll find out. Actually, we might not find out because we, us changing it would have... It's going to flag it anyway, isn't it? Okay, well, that's kind of that. Out the door. So we know we're going to get that penalty. The announcement sh shouldn't be a penalty because we've got that right. Obviously, we before we set off, we did actually change it and get the right one. So basically, what we need to remember is that if we're going, we need to slow down here. If we're going clockwise, we need to be on the outer. If we're going uh, anti, no, hang on. If we're going anti-clockwise, we're on the outer. If we're going it clockwise, we are. Uh, no, wait, hang on. Anti-clockwise is inner. Clockwise is outer. That's what we need to remember. Oops. Slowed right down because I was looking at the map on my other screen and not paying attention to what I should be doing. Oh, God, goodness, love. Just give me a heart attack then. All change. This is Edgware Road. Change. All change, please. 
all change. Well, it does for us. Probably not for the actual... Um, we'll probably get pinged for the messages now. Boom. 77%. Uh, okay, so the following things should be better. The departure schedule was not kept. Rubbish. That's absolute rubbish. That was. That was perfect. Not all cars have stopped at the, any... Oh, really? I thought I was pretty good with the old platform. Never mind. Okay, that's fair enough. Announcements were not correct. Rubbish. Um, the heating was not switched on. Rubbish. I switched that on. I remember distinctly switching that on. And... Uh, Breaking was too hard. Ah, oh, 77%. See, this is just getting ridiculous now. It's a joke. There, there's, there's a conspiracy against us. That's what it is. Anyway, I'll leave it there, guys. Um, I don't know how much more London Underground I'm going to do because I'm literally uh, just going over old ground now. We've done all the missions, and I'm literally just picking one of these and, and doing it. And, you know, we've, we've, we're doing so many of them now that we've, we've done them all. Um, so let me know your thoughts. I... I I'm I'm struggling to it's not as if I can set scenarios or anything and do something different that's all I've got and uh I think we've we've probably milked it as much as we probably can but let me know your thoughts and th thoughts and feelings I know a lot of you will still want to see some but I think we'll gradually start to phase this out because I I can't do one every couple of weeks because there's just not the content left in the game to cover to be fair anyway Let's not try and be negative on the way out. Thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed this. Thoughts and comments, as always, please leave in the section below. And I'll see you next time.